Hello everyone. Today I would like to talk about the BH1750 light intensity sensor, which is the one shown here, and then how to interface it with Arduino so that you can be able to measure the light intensity or the luminance of light in a given area. You can find these sensors in mobile phone displays. They can also be used for turning street lights and car headlights on or off depending on outdoor lighting. So it's a, a very common sensor and quite useful. So before I proceed on how to show you how to connect it with Arduino, let me first look at the sensor itself in detail. So this is our sensor. This is the BH1750 light intensity sensor. As you can see, uh, this is the main chip here. This is the BH1750FVIIC. This contains photodiodes that detect light luminance and also contains a 16-bit analog to digital converter that converts the analog luminance values to give a digital output in lux. Lux is the measurement of illuminancy. That is the total amount of light falling on a given surface. Yeah, even here, another component is this 662K transistor which acts as a voltage regulator meaning that you can use this sensor with microcontrollers that are using 5 volts for example the Arduino. Then if you look at the pins, this is the first pin here, this is the I2C address select pin. So by default it is low and when it is low the device will have an I2C address of 0 times 23. And if you want to change the I2C address then you make it high or you connect it to 5 volts then it will be 0 times 5C. So this is very important if you are going to be using two of these sensors on the same microcontroller. So each of the sensors will have a different I2C address. The next pin is the data pin and this is the clock. So these are the two pins, the data and clock pins are used for I2C communication because this sensor now uses I2C communication with a given microcontroller. Then the next one is the ground and the lastly is the VCC. Actually this VCC can be connected to either 3.3 volts or 5 volts of the Arduino because as I've said there's this onboard regulator therefore you can be able to use it with the 5 volts device. I will now demonstrate how to use the light sensor with Arduino and in this case I'm going to be using the Arduino board and an I2C LCD display so I can be displaying the values of the light intensity on the I2C display. So connecting these devices is very simple because this BH1750 light sensor uses I2C communication and I'm also using a 16x2 I2C LCD. So both of these are going to be connected using the I2C pins of the Arduino. So in this case I'm using Arduino Uno. So my I2C pins are going to be F5 for the clock and F4 for the data pins. In case you're using a different Arduino board, then you need to check out the corresponding pins. So we simply connect. From this side, I'll connect the VCC to Arduino 5 volts. You can also connect it to 5 to 3.3 volts. It can work. Then the next one is the ground. It will be connected to Arduino ground. Then the clock pin is going to go to F5. Then the data pin will go to F4. So I'm going to leave the address select pin floating in other words I will just leave it in its default state which is a low state meaning that the address of my sensor is going to be 0 times to 3 so I also use the same connection almost for the I2C LCD then you can have a simple look at the kind of code that I'm going to be using here so this is the kind of code that we are going to be using so first of all you need to install this library the bh1750.h library it's the one which contains all the necessary functions for the working of the sensor. So then you also need the wire.h library for I2C communication and because I'm going to be using a 16x2 I2C LCD display I will need this liquid crystal I2C.h library for the LCD. Then I'm going to create a simple object which I will call the light meter 
from the BH1750 class and also create an object for the I2C LCD since I'm using a stand by 2 I use this in the setup section I will initialize the I2C communication and also initialize the light sensor using the created object so I use this begin method to initialize the BH1750 light sensor so something I wanted to note that this sensor works in two modes there is a continuous mode or the one-time mode by default it is in the conti continuous high resolution mode but now you can use in different modes if you want if you want for example to use in the one-time high resolution mode you use this kind of setup but right now I'm just looking at the basic working of the sensor therefore I'll just use the normal method which is the continuous high resolution mode then these functions are for the LCD in case you don't know how to use the LCD I always have a number of tutorials on how to use this LCD then the loop section the major concept is here with this read light level method or function this is the one that is going to give the digital output of the sensor in lux it will be given as a float value as lux and then the the print function is going to print that function is going to print the digital value on the lcd then they leave a simple delay of two seconds so the code is not really that hard i put the link to this code in the description below where you can have a look at it and also read more about the different working modes of the bh1750 light sensor so after writing this code you can upload it to your arduino and then we check out how it's going to be working so let's try it out and see yeah let's now upload our code and then we check out and see how this is going to work so the code is now uploaded and as you can see we're now testing our b H1750 light intensity sensor. Uh, current it is showing 88.33 lux. So you can try to adjust the light intensity and see the values you are going to get. So when you are adjusting the light, there, for example, if I increase the light, you see it goes to 200, 237, like that. And as I said, if the light is closer, to the sensor then of course the intensity will be higher if you move the light source away from the sensor or the higher the distance from the light source to the sensor then they lower the light intensity so that's how our bh1750 light sensor works hope you've learned something today don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to like my other tutorials thanks for watching